Hi, I'm Ford Sakes, the CEO of Prime Concepts Group. Now, as many of you may know, I've been the go-to marketing guy for a long list of top professional speakers for many, many years. And I also run a seven-figure speaking business myself. Now, at the upcoming event, you're going to be exposed to several different revenue models. Regardless of which model that you select that best fits your particular business, you're going to need to define compelling value propositions that encourage your audience members to engage in your offers. Now, I've prepared a few quick tips for you to help you create compelling offers. First thing I want you to do is I want you to start by creating a mind map of all of your areas of expertise, your target markets, and identify who the influencers are and who the actual purchasers are for your value propositions. Now, if you're not familiar with mind mapping, then just create a list and you can go from there. Now, once you have your list or your mind map of all your value propositions, your target market, and who the influencers and the purchases are, then I want you to look at that information and I want you to create your product pyramid and look at your price points from free to high fees. Now, let me tell you a little bit more about what that means. Some of you already have products and services that you sell, and that's great. And your products would go from free, maybe free ebooks, all the way up to expensive programs, your keynote presentations, along with consulting deals, maybe uh, learning management systems, and so on. But you need to know what those price points are going to be before you can create all your value propositions. So your value propositions aren't, we're not talking about like a USP or your brand. We're really talking about at what point do you engage your target market and how can they spend money, how can they spend money with you? So now there are two more important questions that you have to ask yourself. First, what problems do you solve that other people will pay to make go away? Or you might ask, what desires do I satisfy? Now the second part of that, the second question would be, what's the best format or formats that my target prospect wants to consume that specific solution in. Meaning, are you gonna create an audio, a video, a text or book, a multimedia program, etc.? Now, once you get clarity on the solution and the format, then you can start to craft a compelling value proposition that will then be used during your presentation, be used on your website, and shared appropriately through your social media network. Now, this is just enough to get your juices flowing. We're gonna go into much more depth at the event. I hope to see you there.